Hi, this is Gabriel Castro from ExoticWoodPen.com. In this video, we're going to talk all about segmenting. It's been a while since I've done a video, so I apologize. And anyway, um, as you can see here, this is done by one of the best segmenters out there. He's um, his name's Jim Goody, and uh, one of the guys that's inspired me to become a pen segmenter. And you can see this is a nice uh, fountain pen and it looks like it's all acrylic and just a beautiful job you can see how much work and how many cuts there are involved in planning and um, I got several pictures of this one here so you can uh, see up close there's the second one here and if you look at the detail of the crossing that comes up here so it's you know crossed back and forth in uh, multiple areas from here, 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 and even on the end. So you can see it's just a lot of planning. And it takes a, a certain person with, a, with an amazing vision to plan all those cuts out and then to actually put it all together and then hope it doesn't blow up on you when you turn the darn thing. And uh, anyway, just an amazing pen there. Let me see if I think I have another one. Nope, that was it. So those two pictures. Uh, this is a nice uh, segmented uh, wine bottle stopper. Uh, just pulled this one off the computer this morning. Um, and uh, a lot of uh, good woods on there from uh, Purple Heart, Orange, Osage, Maple, and Cherry. So just a really good looking piece. Always wanted to make uh, some segmented ones like this all I've ever done with these uh, wine bottle stoppers myself is Celtic knots But man that really looks good makes you really want to get out there, but really good execution You know what that's going to look like when that gets finished. So great job on that one boomer uh, Bob Perez, I think I've posted his before Yes, I have um, anyway. This is a great looking pen here uh, using aluminum and so forth for the segmenting. Um, so we use lace wood. Okay, you can see the lace wood right there coming through. Um, Catalox, Paduk, and aluminum. Really beautiful pen uh, as far as kit, kit pens go. Really nicely done. Great balance. Uh, looks like everything's lined up really good. Um, you know, just a, a great execution there. another one from Jason Baldwin um, I don't know if I've done him on this side or not but uh, this one was a really cool looking pen great angles on this uh, Sierra or Manhattan style pen whatever they're calling them now and uh, just great execution a lot of a lot of work uh, beautiful pen on that one for sure Jim Goody uh, I've got a couple more of his on here and you can see again how much time and energy goes into preparing these blanks and uh, he said you know he's just selling the blanks themselves but uh, I got another picture I think of that one on the next slide there it is and uh, never I don't even know what this material is called it's been a while since I've used it but it really does look really really good so again great job as usual Jim Tyler Herring. I don't think I've uh, reviewed any of this before, but this was a really good looking uh, kit pen. Um, I really like the way it's, it's just a simple segmented pen, but the colors I think is what really makes this one, excuse me, stand out. Really, uh, you know, you don't have to really overdo a segmented pen. Uh, as good as it looks, sometimes simple is just as good also but a really beautiful uh, beautifully done there beautiful design and just a great mix of colors uh, Steve Morris uh, we showed off his before and you can see again a lot of planning and uh, execution here and just a great mix of woods and materials and uh, oh 
again giving me plugs right there so thank you appreciate that so if you haven't had a chance to check out my segmenting videos on YouTube uh, they're still not for sale while I'm in school and not working so and uh, David Shepardson look at this beautiful uh, hardwood mix just a lot a lot going on um, you know sometimes it's just a matter of using the same material and just putting a color line right through it really makes that stand out and really makes it look really good so yeah really gorgeous pen or pens rather and I think that, that was it yeah that is it for this video so thanks again for watching and um, have a good day